Today I wanted to review why you or how to add your blog post to a page um, that is a page beside your blog. I noticed that your home page is actually your blog page. So if I click here on blog pages, your home page, this one, is the blog. So that's where all the blog posts are showing. Now you can add blog posts to secondary pages or pages other than the blog. There's a couple options here. You could either change your home page to not be the blog, so you could rename this and then create a new home page um, and put a feed there, or we can, and this is what we're going to do right now, I'm going to just put a blog feed on your all articles page since right now there's nothing here. So um, we're going to come over here to this plus symbol and then find blog here in the lower area of these menu items. Then click on, let's do post list. Uh, and I usually like this one. You can change them, so don't feel like this is set in stone. And I'm going to show you kind of all the settings here. So it only has three by default, but you can change that. You come in here to settings, and then um, you're looking at your posts. You want to show all posts, or you can also filter them by tags, or just show featured posts if desired. But I don't usually use those features. I just usually use all posts. Then you can also say how many posts to be displayed. So you can choose like up to 50. Um, and then what it will do is you can have it so that it has page numbers at the bottom so that people can kind of pan to the rest of them beyond the 50 posts. Now you can also adjust the display here. So you can say, you can add the writer, the author name if you want. You can put the publish date if you want, reading time, all these kind of things, likes counter that puts the little heart here. So if you want to add any of these features, you can. Um, the layout is also a good place to go to determine how you want it to show up. So let's say you don't want um, three across. I think that actually may have been in the previous one, but we can come here to post. Oh, no, it's right here. So you can choose how many posts you want to show. So you can do two or three or f up to five in each row. I usually like three. So I'm going to leave it at that, but you're welcome to change that. So that's under here under layout. You do have to scroll down in these menus to get to all these additional options. You can also adjust the size of the image so you can make it more square or horizontal or vertical. Um, and it just kind of crops the images in there. You can also say fit, but I don't like that as much. I don't feel like it looks as neat. So I like to crop them all at a consistent size. You can also change the text alignment. You can. Uh, adjust the space between them. You can also adjust the height of the post so they don't have to be quite so tall. Um, and you can also give them more lines, like how much uh, lines you want to have for the title and how many for the description. So you can make the description quite a bit longer. Of course, then you have to adjust the height to adjust for that. Um, but feel free to change this however you feel is best for what you would like. Um, and then you can publish it and go live. So I'm going to actually go up here and publish this. So now your articles page will have all these articles. And you'll see it'll have 50, um, although you don't have 50. But if you did have more, it would show all 50. And then there'd be numbers at the bottom of the page so they could pan to the, to the following posts as well. A few other things to review. You can choose different layouts. Um, so feel free to play around with them if, if you want to try going to different styles. Um, so feel free to play around with it. I like this magazine a lot. It puts a, a fade back on the, the uh, image and then puts the title over top of it. This one's nice because you can read a little bit of the article first. So I'm going to leave it at this one, but feel free to modify and play around with this um, as desired. And keep in mind, yeah, you can determine how many per row. You can determine spacing and all of that stuff here in the settings of this post list. So. I'm going to, again, go ahead and publish. Um, this is going to go live to your site now, so now your all articles will have your blog posts. Um, let me know if you do want to change it over to the home page or change your blog to be the home page, but I think this is the easiest, fastest way to fix what you want it to do. Um, so that way you can have your blog on your home page and then also have all those blog articles featured here. Happy Wixen!